in this example, we are given that two wires are fixed on a sonometer wire. The tensions are in the ratio 8 is to 1. The lens in the ratio 36 is to 35. The diameters in ratio 4 is to 1. And the densities in ratio 1 is to 2. And we are required to find the frequency of beats produced if the note of higher pitch has a frequency of 360 hertz. Here by using the given data we need to evaluate the other frequency and then we will find out the difference to find the beat frequency. Here you can say for the two wires, we can state frequency of first wire can be written as 1 by 2 L1 root of T1 by mu1. And N2 can be given as the frequency of second wire as 1 by 2 L2 root of T2 by mu2. Here we can also write the linear mass density as the product of density and cross sectional area. So here we can write N1 as equals to 1 by 2 L1 root of T1 by pi R1 square rho1. And this N2 can be written as 1 by 2 L2 root of T2 by pi R2 square rho2. Now, we know that uh, the ratio of these two frequencies N1 and N2 will depend on other parameters as, and if we find out the ratios N1 and N2, this can be given as, uh, if we just divide these expressions, this will be L2 by L1 a root of, uh, here we can write T1 R2 square rho2 upon T2 R1 square rho1. And we can substitute the ratios like uh, the ratio of lengths is given as 36 is to 35. So here we can substitute 35 by 36. And in the root, uh, the ratio of tension T1 by T2 is 8 is to 1. We can write 8 by 1. The ratio of uh, radii is given to us uh, 4 is to 1. So this is R2 by R1. We can write it 1 by 4 all square. And the ratio of densities is 1 is to 2. It is rho 2 by rho 1. So we can write it 2 by 1. And here you can see inside the radical sign the parameters are getting cancelled out. The ratio is 35 by 36. It is saying the note of higher pitches of frequency 360 hertz here and 2 will be higher. So we can write other frequency and 1 can be given as 35 by 36 into and 2 which is 360. So this will be 350 hertz. As one frequency is 360 years and other is 350 years. So we can find out uh, beat frequency which is produced by sounding the two frequencies together. It will be N2 minus N1 which is 360 minus 350. The result is 10 hertz. That will be the answer to this problem.